week starts, it feels the same. You know, everybody's working hard as usual. People may not say it, but as they get closer to their pro days, you know, you can you can see the tension, you can see anxiety starting to rise, you know, nerves starting to get at them. Everybody's starting to ask different questions. It's harder to tell a player that that hasn't really been through it yet. You know, I've seen it. I watched it you know, full circle last year. I saw Shed, Eric, you know, Dex, Daquan. I've seen most of them go through it. Get anxious the same exact way, and then when they do their 40, you know, their drills. After they finish, they realize like everything that Cliff was trying to tell them was absolutely correct. You know, just. Just literally stay the course, you know, the certain drills that they're learning, the certain things that they're doing, or there's reasons too why they're doing it to create the muscle memory. So when they get on the field for their pro day, it just becomes natural. On Tuesday, the players went through the regular circuit, still with hot yoga. They can get up to about 98 degrees. And exhale, release the breath from your chest and then your belly. Draw your navel into your spine as you exhale. And you come to the bottom of your breath, inhale, breathe in. Exhale, reach a little deeper. Okay, ready? We're gonna rock forward on that right foot. Come forward to a forward fold. You can practice this at home with pants on. You won't sweat. Okay? Good, good. Sorry, let me get out of the way. Damn, I can't hold it. I can't hold it. Shit was serious. Got real today, I ain't gonna lie. I don't even say nothing to the camera, it was real today. After Tuesday, I hit the plane straight to Indy. Yep. You're feeling alright? Mm hmm. I'm gonna loose all fucking ring. <laughs> yep, good. I'm gonna do some uh, mobility cupping and shit tonight too. Okay. Yep, yep. I'll have you just go up, back. We all know Favo as, you know, maybe the clown of the group or, you know, one of the funniest people, as we all like to say. But I noticed that, you know, the laughing stopped. The smiles, you know, they <laughs> they came to a halt. You know, Favo was locked in. I ain't never seen this man locked in like that before. There you go to the floor. And now watch you on take off. Go, 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 Makes no mistake. And he wanted to see what the club said. Hey, bring it. Come on, man. So, <laughs> Look at Justin. On, man. Good young man here, doing good. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. We're just coming After Fable's workout, we just walked through the convention center. You know, saw all these little cool different tables, things that other people had to sell. No, I, I, I mean. And there's this cool brand called Sucker Punch, you know, pickle shots and pickles. Man, I've never had a pickle shot in my life. I went back and grabbed another one. It was really good. How you doing? What's going on, man? How you doing? Good to see you, bro. How you doing? The man with the plan right here, y'all. Color Sports Group Combine. We here with it. As you went, all right, guys, you're not going to run your best time today. Come on. We're going to get out there. We're going to execute the plan. Like, I was like, all right. Yeah, that's fine. I appreciate that, man. So, it was so I dope. That. I appreciate that. I really appreciate that. that. I really appreciate that. That's crazy. Oh, you on that? Did you watch it? Yeah. I appreciate that. I watched it every, every one that you put out. Every single one. Really? Every single one. That's what yeah. I'm saying. Like, I, I know your guys' name. I can't stop. I can't stop. No, we see it. Because, like, content people, like, a lot of them can't get the athletes to like, talk into the camera. And we just headed straight back to the hotel after meeting some people. Said so I made a hundred and fifty. I'm not the guy for that. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, free dog. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> Now you shrug the shoulder up, oh. tilt your head this way. I'm gonna pin right here, and you're gonna roll down and across like that. That cool? Uh, yeah. Cool. So climb that way again, shrug that shoulder up, then down and across. I'm the first one to get the combine in white, baby. Yes, sir. I'm a legend. <laughs> so, put some more pressure on now. Yep, yep. Give you shake it on camera. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> 
Austin is good at his job. Austin is knowledgeable at just anatomy and just how bones and the body works in ways that you may not even know that you need it. Oh shit! <laughs> oh! Oh shit! You're alive there? <laughs> oh, hold on. <laughs> oh shit! Hold on. Oh. Fuck. Snap, crack, pop. Want any cuffs on the low back? Yeah. Is that right after this? Walking, yeah, seriously, man. See why you wouldn't play. Right, you get what I'm saying? Like that's the only thing. <laughs> I've been waiting on this. Don't come to Indy without the pure breadsticks or Lawrence Donuts. Swear, best donuts ever. No, I don't want her. Straight up, I don't want her anymore. My, 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 my taste. Life comes full circle, don't it? It's not what happens to you, it's how you respond. Just stay the course. Oh, you're just, you said last night, you just handed out to the DVDs to anybody that you saw. Your DVDs, your business cards. <laughs> yes, sir. Last night was just a start. I was just walking around, just handing out my tape. If I see a logo or I see a business, I just stop, hand them my highlight tape, just ask for a few minutes of their time, just, uh, just introduce myself, and maybe they can just check out my film. As Fabo was going through his drills, you know, Fabo went out there and does what Fabo does best, honestly. You know, none of us were surprised to see him out there doing the positional work and absolutely killing it. We were just honestly all proud of him to see him out there, you know, doing his thing. But we know on his pro day, he's absolutely going to kill it. Perfect. 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 I'm coming right there right now. I got my man J-Ho straight out of Nashville. You feel me? What's he good? here. Oh, what's what's good? good? My brother. Good. My brother. He what's here. Up? What's up? So what's ran up? into him in the city, man. Y'all tuned in, and This is one of the best in the business. Hands down. No questions asked. Operation 53. If you ain't locked in, you're missing out. Straight up. Hey, you've been running the show though. I've been trying to stay oh, running. Just ready to put the work on display. You know. So it's mixed emotions for me. Just seeing everything go full circle from seeing a lot of the of my peers that I started this with. Um and been kind of somewhat disconnected from them for a while to see them again all in one spot, man. Even my mentor, Cliff Marshall, that yeah. found me all the streets, handing out DVDs and turned me into a strength coach, just getting to see him again. Um, and just kind of tying all those things together over this, you know, somewhat 10 year journey of coaching. Seeing them all in one location, all in one, you know, week pretty much is like, it's mixed emotions, but you know, the main thing is the main thing. And that's the, let's get Fabo to perform at his best, you know. He's anxious, he's ready to go, because he's a competitor, he wants to do it, and I want him to do it too. Um, there's a time and there's a place, so we're just gonna put it all together. So I'm more so excited about the future, but definitely seeing how you know God brought it full circle from everything in my past. It's 
stay the course. Kind of figuring out what position you were going to play on the field, you had to kind of figure out what you were really good at, what you connected with, what made you you. Right? Does that kind of start to make sense? Right? So now that same kind of mindset beyond just football, but in life, because that's going to, especially in these next few years when you guys are taking advantage of this wave of sports marketing that's happening right now, you're going to be able to hopefully build connections to brands that you can build relationships with way beyond playing football. That's also the goal here today. Like a guy at the town that was like my track coach, who was like my big brother, and I told him I would train with him and put him on type shit. So uh, I was the only person. It was like real good, because one on one, that's usually how I do train. But I could have went to the Exos and all that, but I didn't do that. I just stayed loyal to my dude. And uh, shit, I just worked my ass off, bro, like every day. Put in the time, I did what I needed to do. And then pro day, shit, a week before pro day, I fired my agent. Cause it just wasn't doing what he was supposed to do that I felt like. And that's the one advice I can tell y'all, like, bro, it's y'all opportunity, you feel me? Like, you young boss, bro. If you feel like somebody ain't doing what they're doing, get them the fuck out, the, get them the fuck out the way. Cause, mind you, if you make it, they not out there running and doing all this shit that's gonna require you to be on the team. So why the fuck would you break bread with them? If you don't feel like they doing what you think they should be doing, Give them the fuck out of the way. I'm on page number four, bro. I don't waste no time, cause what the fuck? Like, they not out there running. Every day that I'm not on the team, I'm still putting in work. You wanna have these people in your life, make sure they busting their ass just like you busting your ass. Like, this your dream, this your opportunity. And if you're not gonna play with it, don't let nobody else play with it. You feel me? Because when you get cut and you at the crib, guess what? He gonna have another draft class here next year. Well, he might be able to fuck with y'all, but it ain't much he can do for everybody. Right. Like, it's just real shit. So always put yourself first, bro. You are a fucking boss now, bro. No matter how young you is, no matter how old whoever your agent is, fuck that, he work for you. You call shots and always keep it like that. Never give up that power, bro, because you the one that gotta cut the check.